Uh, okay, so we can go with 1C. Um, 7A. 1C, 55BD. Let's do that, right? Oh no, game, why'd you do that to me? Oh, and I can't, now I can't finish it. Now I failed. God damn it. Because I need BD and I've not got a BD after this. That's unfortunate. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Unfortunate. I mean, I got two out of three, so. I mean, you may as well rob the place, right? Oh, no, I shouldn't have done that. Damn it. Money is... Really cool apartment you've got going on here. I like it. Oh, I missed this. What? Skill shard engineer. Nice. Gain skill for the egg XP for the engineering skill. Very good. Very cool. If you go in the toilet, some meds. Excellent. Neutralize. So how do we do this? Like that, I guess. Dismemberment turned off. What's happening here? Can you even turn that off? I don't even know if you can turn that off. <laughs> All right, now we've got to get out. Oops, wrong button. Uh, where's my guy? This guy. Hopefully we can get him out of the way again. Search. Suspicious activity. Is he going to move at all, or is he, is he just is he's just staying there? Is that his life now? You see, sometimes, sometimes it doesn't stack, and that's why I don't like the idea of queuing it. You know, using this queue that we can do here because it doesn't always apply everything that I that I apply. But I mean, fifty percent extra damage when it's locked isn't terrible, so can't really complain too much with it, right? Okay, so now this time he does nothing again. What the? 
Sweeping the area. Seriously, dude. Quick, 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 quick. Ooh! Okay, we got away with it. Then we can just leave the way we came in. I mean, this method works too. This, with the current hacks and the current guns I have, killing them all with the way I wanted to with the gun and the hacks would have taken forever to get this one right. I'm out. I'm out. Well, I, I did escape the hotel. I'm out. Okay, hello game. Oh. Weird, I had to go all the way down here for it to fit to work. Odd. Got word, Joanne Coke bit the dust. Preen. Not that I love more than working with pros. Gig's closed. The eddies are on their way. Yeah. Do I get a bonus? Oh, no bonus. We're going to go pay Victor, uh, and then we'll do the Takamura stuff. Hey now, you 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 jumped in the way of me, buddy. Not the other way around, okay? Let's go pay our guy. Noise. Nice power slide. Oh, it's a little, little tight. No, wrong button. God damn it! Oh. Uh oh. Nailed it. Hey, Misty. Where's the kitty? Where's the kitty? I want to pet the kitty. Where's the cat at? That's rubbish. Hey, Vic. Finally scrounged up enough eddies to pay you back in full. Hold on to him just in case. You need him more than me. Not taking him all the way to my grave. But here. And thanks again for doing so much work on me without ever seeing an any. That's what friends are for. Vic's a real solid I was guy. Thinking about swapping some chrome. 
Got any new toys? Have a look. It'd be cool if Vic gave you like some of the best gear in the game, but he doesn't tend to. Well, at least I don't remember him doing. A Kresnikov. What does this do? In improves Kresnikov by enhancing the user's speed and reflexes. When Kresnikov is active, oh, it's a, it's an activey thingy. Uh, automatically negates an enemy quick hack. That's quite handy, actually. I need some more chrome, man. I need some more chrome uh, capacity. Thanks for nothing, Vic. I'm just kidding. He actually didn't have that bad. That bad of gear. Wait, where's my... Where's my motorbike? Hold up. Did somebody steal my motorbike? Where's it going? Oh, it's like a holographic recording of the crime. It's interesting. Sit. You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. Why does it keep doing that? Uh, why'd you help me? Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. Is this about the biochip? This about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. Uh, what do you want? What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorino Varasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. Been thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. I uh, just answered your own question. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Uh, no idea. Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure, but... She showed that slyness you get in Corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? <sighs> uh, okay, got a life to save my own, so... Sorry, I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose. B, so... wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice? In Night City? I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. <laughs> I have it's allies true. prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. Uh, want me to accuse Yorinobu in front of Arasaka execs. So what, we stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. 
This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Uh, Anders Hellman. I mean those kinds of people. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. Hanako-sama, oai tekite koei desu. Kochira koso. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... A fucking sucker scums everywhere. Hey! I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? Oh. You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Chill, man. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. I think you're in the wrong neighborhood, buddy. You need to be careful, huh? Uh, shouldn't draw attention to ourselves. Last thing we want to do is draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. At least he understands. I uh, need time to think over it. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. Relic's engineer uh, knows more than anybody else. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why were you looking for Hellman? Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Sabro-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corpo rats squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called The Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the Queen of Fixers there. Rogue. Uh, she spot you in... Uh, she spot the corpo in you. She take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. <laughs> Time to look with Evelyn Parker. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. You're an Obu Arasaka degree? I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends. Call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Thanks. So then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. 
Osaka's oh, still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. We buddies now? You know, you've got some nerve. First you're out to kill me, now you want to be my pal make like nothing happened? You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. <laughs> Sorry. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. Uh, you can help me, please. You are the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you've had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What would I say to her? I got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seen your memories. Gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Can't get out of that door. Alrighty. So where does that leave us? We've got to go uh, afterlife. What is this? Ah, uh, yeah, it's the tarot cards. Yeah, that's right. Where is it? Over here? Hey, look. Oh, interesting. Would you look at that? You see it too, right? Either gone completely whacked or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Yeah. More likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe ask them both. Uh -huh. Oh, call V. Uh, call Judy. That's noise. So what do we got? Full on the hill. Talk to Misty. That's about the tarot cards. We'll talk to Victor. I think we'll talk to Misty about that one. Uh, happy together. Talk to the cops. Oh, yeah. I've got to do that one. I've got to go find the reason. Uh, just some more gigs and stuff, which is nice because we're getting some more things now. Oh yeah, I forgot you could rent new apartments now. One time fee, 10,000 to rent a new apartment. Cool. Well, now expensive they get. 110k, there you go. Corpo Plaza Department. Oh, nice, nice. This one, 80k. So quite expensive, quite quite expensive. Jeez, getting a lot of money for that kind of stuff. All right, a lot of side stuff to do. But when it comes to main story, I think I mean we got automatic love with Judy. I think we give her a call. Uh, we've got Phantom Liberty, which is actually you know find out more about Evelyn Parker. That's also part of the story. Main story. Then obviously Ghost Town, we go speak to uh, uh, to Rogue. Uh, yeah. Okay, let's uh, let's give Judy a call. Uh, so did I. And thinking me dead. Thought it was game over for me too. Things went ass up, huh? Not as planned. Want to talk to Evelyn? Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. Know where she is? What I just said. Drop it. I won't tell you again. Let's meet. Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Oh uh, wait, was that it? Did I interrupt something or was that it? Might as well talk to Misty while we're here too. Saw a weird image out on the street. 
Seems like your line of work. What'd it look like? Grab the scan, take a look. Tarot. Major Arcanum. What you saw was a sign from a higher power. A higher power could be a little clearer. Be a little easier if this higher power learned to be direct. Well, the world is a maze of illusions. It's not easy for the light to shine into the prison of our earthly existence. Right, great. So, what do I do with a sign I can't understand from a power I know nothing about? I'd start by looking for more of them. The tarot describes a road, so go down it. Uh, what do I do when I... Sorry, what do I do with what I find? Still don't know what I'm supposed to do with what I find. Look for more images. They must have some connection to the place where you find them. Think about what you see. You ask me? They've been sent to help you find the truth. Oh, finding the truth is pretty far down on my list at the moment. A difficult time is coming when you'll have to choose which road to take. Then, you'll understand. Dunno. Come on back when you've found more. I'll help you decipher what you've seen. Thanks. Uh, right. So let's go see... Judy. Nope, wrong button. Gotta stop doing that. Okay. There we go. Oh. Oh. oh my word. Okay, 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 okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. Not bad. I think I'm getting better. Yeah, no. Uh. Okay, went the wrong way, no problem. Just do a Yui. Oh my god, hello. Who are you guys? That's kind of scary. Whoa. Actually, I should be able to have cars now, right? Let's see. Can I see? Oh, look. Another tarot card. Oh, okay. So, take control. Enables remote operation, allowing you to take control of turrets. And at times, other devices. Floor it. Floor it, buddy. That just flies off. Oh, hey, don't run me over. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, well, I suppose I deserve that. Fine. He uses a lot of uh, RAM. <laughs> what the? F Guy just went flying down there. Love it. It's actually quite funny. Oh, I need a lot more RAM. I'm curious to try to take over. What, is, what have I got here that I need to do? Uh, we need to talk. It's important. This is to Evelyn. Evelyn Parker is typing. Oh, unable to deliver a message. Okay, not good. Uh, thanks, I'll check it out. So I'm curious here. What if I take control? <laughs> I can drive the car. Roadkill. Oh dear. Sorry about that. <laughs> Signal strength is going down. Uh oh. Oh, so I have to keep it close by. This is actually great. Get a job. Stop scaring people. I almost actually ran myself over. That was just, that was quite scary. <laughs> I think it's fabulous that I could take over a car just drive it around like this. Get a job. 
How do I stop taking control of the car? Oh, exit F. That's actually brilliant. Emergency brake. Love it. I think the fact that I could just take control of a car and just run people over with it is is just the greatest ever. Hi. Hey, haven't I seen you here before? Maybe. Got a good memory for faces. We're closed right now. Uh, Judy around? Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den. Yep. Take the stairs down. Thanks. Whoa, whoa, start again. What is it you want us to do now? Place is closed, but uh, it looks like it's full to me. Embarrassing herself again. Hey, where are you going? Nothing to see back Let here. It lie. Judy's right. How can my sprint? Is my sprint broken? What's happening to sprint right now? Stop telling every joy toy you need to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. Hey, you want me to? Uh, you want me to deal with her? I can can do that for you. That's you no just problem. Don't give up, do you? No, I don't. Got nothing more to say to each other. Thought I made that clear. Or was Mox. I just too subtle for you? Mox reminded me of the nomads. We get it Moxes together. and nomads don't seem so different. Both seem to yammer a lot about community, solidarity. Classic dilemma. What comes first, family or the outside this world? This is a club. Nobody cares about your lofty world views. Uh, what was that all about? What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. Looking for Evelyn. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Uh, just need to know who hired her. Need to find out who she was working for. That's it? That's it. Judy, you don't need to worry. I won't lay a hand on her. Wouldn't make sense. Fine. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Huh? <laughs> Mega Tower. <laughs> Luxurious. Thanks, Judy. You're gonna be great friends, you and me. You still need something? Uh she went back there. Think she might have gone back there? Said it'd be safer than here. God knows why. Alrighty. Um just let me know how she's doing. Okay. Oh, I'll give you a call. Give you a call. Okay. Thanks. Thank you, V. No problem, Evelyn. No problem. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram and a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. That point. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? Is that all you got, Chief? Uh, we're done? We're done. Okay, thanks, man. Good talk. <laughs> Good prep talk, buddy. I can't sprint. Is it broken, or am I just not allowed to sprint in here? Just got the nice squelching of my boots or my pants, whatever it is. Probably my pants, actually. Boy, that's a good point. I need to go and uh, update my fashion. Look at this guy. Still, unfortunately, still parked here. Mr. Hands. Hello. The name is Hands. Mr. Hands. 
If you're looking for work in Pacifica, I'm the man to call. I'm V. No, nice to meet you. All right. How very nice to meet you. If you have business, you know my number. Thanks, Hans. Oh, there it is. It's like, where's my motorbike? It's over there. Come here. Yoink. Exactly how I wanted that to go. Like, like, <laughs> just precisely how I was expecting it to, to, to turn out. Okay, okay, here we go. So, where is this place? Oh, over there. Okay. Oh. Wait, isn't this my apartment? No, right? Yeah, no, no. No. I keep pressing E to interact instead of F, and it's really frustrating because it activates my uh, my overdrive. Hey, I from see the only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. What have I missed this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Tiger claws have ties to Arasaka. Arasaka and the tiger claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every corp plays dirty. Except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corpse leave it to the gang, suits collars, and gets soiled. Surprised? No, I mean, if Evelyn wanted to disappear, especially from Arasaka, she could have done better. This whole situation's bent over, cheeks spread wide. Uh, why don't you believe Judy? You think Judy's lying? Why? A little something called intuition, V. Ever heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. <laughs> Let me get along so. So nicely, it's lovely. Alrighty, so we got up here. Wait, wait, what's this? Oh, sit and wait until the evening. Alrighty, can do. Hi right there. This seems like a nice place. And really have to squish like this as I walk. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. One more thrice. Would you take Jack into the terminal? Ah, uh, Jack into the personal isn't safe. You realize personal links aren't secure, right? Could get hit with malware straight to my core. Into paying an arm and a leg for a ripper dog. We need data from your core to pair you up with the doll. Oh. Meaning a biometric scan? Just that. If anything goes wrong, you can lodge a complaint. But that's never happened. Uh, okay. All right, let's do this. It's surely to this be a really bad be idea. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Samurai. Samurai. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. 
scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Matches. Interesting. Is that normal or who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? Um go with nice we kept the pictures up so I could see who I was picking here. Let's go with Sky. Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. Five hundred. Fine. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Okay. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. <laughs> Clouds is one of the safest places in all of Night City. Oh. Pause it, weapons, fine. Hi, everybody. Take this. Hi, right, how's it going? I'm gonna turn that off. So, what if you could sneak in here instead of actually coming in here legitimately? I guess you probably could. I don't know if it's going to help you or not. Guess that makes you a real deviant. Because of I'd you. I had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. <laughs> What's that noise? Somebody having a bad time? Confused. Not bad, but it would be much better. I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week. You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am. No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here, now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. Okay. At least I would hear no laments about pain. It's her. It's her. Hi there. Hi. I'm Sky. And you must be Valerie. Hi, Sky. Um, it's just V. V. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay, then. V. Well, looks like this will be interesting. So, V. You're dying. Oh, safe word. Samurai. Immediately get me out of here. Now, let's see. Uh, how'd you know... I'm dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. Uh, there's something in those mirrors. There's something in those mirrors way back it's a projection your inner landscape just what i needed 
therapy with a robo-hooker. <laughs> I'm not here to analyze you. That's not something I do. I'm here to fulfill your deepest, most hidden desire. Oh, okay, okay. I'm looking for someone. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. Asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. Um... What am I afraid of? I think you know me well. Okay. Tell me what I'm so afraid of. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody's entitled to secrets. Got my own with good reason, too. Say it. Say it out loud. Not for me, but for yourself. Uh, died and now I'm dying again. Happy? I snuffed it once and I'm going to do it all over again. Got no idea how to stop it. There. Happy. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased. As if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different. Um, the void freaks me out. Death is death is death. You're gone. Game over. You can't know that for certain, even if you've been there and back. Believe me, I've seen it. And it's fucking boring. You haven't stopped grieving since. Or for what's to come. Grief doesn't begin to describe it. What I've been through... Tough to move on from that. Death was something that happened to other people. Hell that I dealt to others. Now my number will be up. Wasn't enough I died once. Have to go and do it again. Death's absurdity. The futile struggle before. These terrify you. Uh, so what now? <sighs> so what now? You find out what it is you need to do. Which is? You gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should have. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you now. Uh, not sure I can manage. How do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Uh, thank you. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez, don't even feel like getting up. Few do. But everything has its end. Safe word, samurai. Samurai. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk? 
You pulled the emergency brake. Ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? Uh, thanks for the chat. That was refreshing. A lot of things been going on in my head lately. But this was... different. Refreshing. That's what we do at Clouds. I get why people come here. Come back. But I need something else. What do you know about Evelyn? Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. Ooh. People like you, Barjan, violate it, try to rearrange. No. I need your help, please. You gotta help me. Please. I'm no threat. But she could be in trouble. Just want to talk to her, find out if she's okay. In case you haven't noticed, doll work's not the most secure job in the world. One day you're in, the next you're out. And maybe gone. Anything out of the ordinary happen here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. Oh. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody would care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where'll I find him? VIP area. Booth 2, I think. Thanks. See? You turned out to be useful after all. <laughs> what I mean, I think she did at least help before that as well. So, I gotta get over here, and I'm not gonna just gonna walk right up in there. Can I get in here, Chief? No, all right then. Can I talk to you? Second no. Floor is for VIP customers only. Oh yeah. You wanna let me in? No, sir. What I wanted to do. Dude, you're getting it on the floor. Come on, man. Jeez. I'll close that back up for you. Oh, if only I could get to there, that would work. Ah, oh, damn it. Ready, so. I mean, I can't just open this door. That doesn't. How can I see this person through here? Hostile area? No. Oh. Damn it. <laughs> Whoops. I was wondering where that window would open up to. I was like, ooh, window. And then it's just right where I couldn't get to anyway, so. A routine inspection has shown many have been corrupted with malware. Police experts have confirmed the identified virus due to cyberware failure and in extreme cases. Oh, I don't have my weapons. In response to increased ah, that's really unfortunate. The mayor's office has raised the public threat level to one. Residents of Arroyo and Watson are advised not to leave their homes after dark. And always ensure easy access to protective firearms. Schools and hospitals have been closed until further notice. What's next for Pacifica? The district formerly designed as an elite. Solves that problem. 
Now I have a VIP card. Alrighty, so let's see what we got here. We can go... Um... Hmm. Maybe 55. 7A. No. no, that's probably not a great idea. 55. 9E. 1C? 7A and 1C, 7A. Something like that, right? That was awful. Well, never mind. VIP lounge here, I come. Are you guys going to be upset with me, or do I need to pretend that I'm a uh, that I'm cool? Uh, okay, 55, uh, 1C, no, 1C, where's, where's BD? Oh, right here, there's like one, there's li literally like there's one, okay, now that's cool I guess, so you go 50, 55 here doesn't make much sense, oh, here we go, 7A, 55, BD, 55 E91C. Let's try that. Damn. Damn. I'm in two out of two out of three, and at least I got the, the quick hack thing. Uh oh. I have a feeling. You better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much. Even for me. More like hard life. Cool. I I I got it I got a ticket. I'm good. I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure, uh... I don't have your details? Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. I want to talk to Evelyn. You need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. Mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo for a new faceplate. A new faceplate? Jeez, how much damage did this customer do? She tell you uh, she was leaving? Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Uh, who is this Woodman? Woodman? Who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. All right, Johnny. Relax, buddy. We're doing fine. So I gotta go in here. Nailed it. All right, what do we got over here? Can I get through the store? I don't think so. No. 
Ooh, I missed this though. What's this? Uh, Kartana. So yeah, right here. God damn it. So that'll be it for this episode. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next one.